Welcome back. It's me again. It's teacher Liza. So, how are you today? I hope you're feeling good. Can we sing the good morning song before we start our lesson? Okay, are you ready to sing with me? Yes! Okay, let's sing. Good morning to you. Yes, yes! Good morning to you. Yes, yes! Good morning, dear students. Good morning to you. Yes, yes! Good morning to you. Yes, yes! Good morning to you. Yes, yes! Good morning, dear students. Good morning to you. Great job! All right, so today is a good morning. Good morning and the sun is up. Okay, now, what is the day today? Do you know what is the day today? Is it Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, or Saturday? Hmm, today is Thursday. And we also have a special song for the days of the week. Are you ready to sing with me? Oh. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday, the day I love the best. Again, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Saturday, the day I love the best. Great job, you! Great job! That was very good! Alright, so before the days of the week, let's also find out what is the weather today, Teacher Liza. Is it sunny, windy, stormy? Oh, last night it was stormy. A very big storm last night and there was a lot of rain. It was very rainy as well. And then is it snowy, foggy, cold or hot? Alright, so that is the weather today. If I look outside, hmm, the weather today is sunny. Well, where I live, it's always either sunny or rainy <laughs> okay and it could be very very hot Ooh, all right so that is the weather today now what is our letter of the day we are going to continue with the letter u okay we are now on the letter u yay we're almost finished with the letters teacher life that's such a good achievement thank you too for listening to me all right so we are doing the letter u and the sound of the letter u is ah 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 okay all right Today, I would also like to ask you, how are you feeling today? Are you happy? Like this? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Bop, bop, bop. Are you happy? Yes, you are happy. Or maybe some of you are feeling <laughs> sad. If you're sad and you know it, try <gasps> Are you sad? Sad, you're happy, I get it, all right. Or maybe some of you are. <gasps> if you're angry and you know it, pull your hair. Are you angry? I hope you're not angry because it's a good day today and we should not be angry. But maybe some of you are. <gasps> If you're surprised, then you know it's a hooray. Ah, <gasps> hooray! Okay, surprised. Or maybe some of you, 
If you're scared and you know it, bite your nails. Are you scared? Oh, maybe you're scared of the ghost or the monsters or the big dinosaur or the big shark. You can be scared. Right. And some of you are feeling good. You just want to give kisses. Mwah, mwah, mwah. All right. So those are your feelings today. Great job. Oh, where's my great job? I'm going to give you a big great job. A thumbs up, you guys. All right. So now let's proceed with our letter U. Okay. The letter U for a, uh, a. Uh. Uh, uh. Okay, so what are the words hmm, that starts with the letter U? The first word that starts with the letter U is a, a thing that use this when it's raining. <gasps> it's an umbrella. I hope you have an umbrella. Do you have an umbrella? Yeah. Yes, you do. An umbrella is used when it's raining. And sometimes we do it too when it's really, really hot or sunny outside. Okay? So, umbrella. It starts with the letter U. And if I'm not mistaken, my umbrella is color yellow. If you look at our color chart, this is yellow. Our umbrella is yellow. So, let's put our umbrella here. Okay, good. Our next word that starts with the letter U is Ta-da! It's under. Ooh, where is the cat, teacher Liza? If you look at the cat, the cat is under. The table. Oh my, the cat is hiding under the table and it's home sleeping. Hmm, do you like to go under the table? Yeah! Oh, you do? Oh, me too. I like to go under the table and hide just like the cat. So it starts with the letter U for under. Can you repeat? After me and say under. Okay, great job. Let's put it here. Alright. Next. What are the other words that starts with the letter U, teacher Liza? Our next word that starts with the letter U is something that you use every day. Hmm. What is that something that we use? Every day, we put it um, on our on our legs, on our shirt. Ooh, what is this? We use this every day and change this every day. Ooh, it's of different colors. So I think green, blue, all the color chart. It's there. It's a bada and under. Call this one an underwear, or some may call it as an underpants. Okay, so we have your panty and your brief, so we call it an underwear. All right, I hope you're wearing an underwear now or an underpants. Are you okay? Yes, you are. So again, repeat after me and say underwear. Okay. So this is an underwear. Look at all those different colors. There's yellow, there's pink, there's blue. Okay, that's an underwear. Let's put it on the board. Okay. Our next word that starts with the letter U is a... Mm -hmm. What is this? Are you ready? Dun 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 Ta da! Oh! Oh! Oh my! There's a lot of them. They're falling up in the sky. This is a 
a unicorn. What is this? It's a beautiful unicorn. Do you know where to find the unicorn? Hmm. We can find the unicorn in the where? We find them at the end of the rainbow. If you see a rainbow, if you look at it, at the end of the rainbow is a unicorn, all right? And at the same time, at the unicorn, there are pot of gold, all right? So at the end of the rainbow, rather, there's a pot of gold. So what is this again? A unicorn, okay? Like this one. She is a unicorn. Hi, unicorn. Okay? Alright, so a unicorn. Let's put our unicorn on the board. They are beautiful sleeping unicorns. So I'm gonna transfer this one in here. Alright, our next word that starts with the letter U is a... Bam, 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 Did you see it? Bam, did you see it? No, it's a... Oh, what is this, teacher Liza? This is a a unicycle. Okay, why is it a unicycle, not a bicycle? Okay, this is a bicycle. A bicycle has two wheels, right? It got one, two. It got two wheels. That's a bicycle. But this one, it got only one wheel. So it's a unicycle. Can you repeat after me and say unicycle, okay? Unicycle. Normally, clowns and acrobat experts use the unicycle. I don't have a unicycle. I have a bicycle. Alright? So again, repeat after me and say unicycle. Great job, unicycle. So let's put it here. Ah, oh my. Our last. And final word, the star with the letter U is A. <gasps> it is a big school. We call this a big school. And it is where most students go to school when they are in college. Sometimes we call it a college, but sometimes we call it and it's a really big school, we call it a university, okay? When you go to college to finish your degree, you go to the university, okay? So like me, I finished in a prestigious university in my area, which is Silliman University. So I hope you know this school is quite popular. And I'm proud to be a graduate of a of a university which is Silliman University, okay? So this is university, okay? So I hope you are ready to go to the university soon after you learn with teacher Liza and you'll be bigger, you can go to the university, okay? So help me put the university over here. Let's put it here. Okay. So now, let's review all the words that starts with the letter U. <laughs> okay, so let's start off with umbrella. Next, we have unicycle. <gasps> then we also have underwear or an underpants. Then we have the beautiful, beautiful unicorn. And then we also have the cat sleeping under the table. It's under. Okay, and our last and final word is 
University. Okay, great job you! So I'm gonna give you a big thumbs up. So those are the words that starts with the letter U. Again, this is the mama letter U. And this is the baby letter U. Again, one more time. This is the mama U. And this is the baby letter U. Okay, so and that's the letter U and the sound of the letter U is a, uh, a, uh, a, uh, a. Uh. Sometimes we say U. It's not good simple Okay, so I hope you learn a lot today with Teacher Liza. I will see you again next time on our next lesson. Okay, goodbye to you. Goodbye to you. Goodbye, dear students. Goodbye to you.